am I as a as a learner have utmost freedom to choose who I want to learn from, what I want to learn from there. And then through through God-given intellect, through God-given uh, uh, strength of decision-making and all this, I can actually pick and choose what I think logically makes sense uh, through all the information that I've gotten. Is that correct? Uh, logically, when it comes to, for example, the atiqadat, uh, the, 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 the creed that you follow, the aqidah, yes, there's the... There's a place of logic and intellect there because you have to think. You can't follow. Um, you can't um, rely on the religious texts. Mm -hmm. But when it comes to fiqh, for example, reaching a religious ruling, then it's not about uh, a ruling being logical or not. But rather, it's about the evidence uh, that uh, followed, like the Quran and the Sunnah. You know. So if you are able to. Um, tell the difference between the different rulings based on the evidence that are provided, then barakallah. If not, then this is where the taqlid comes uh, to place. You, thought you go back to someone that is qualified in fiqh, right? While in aqidah you have this freedom and in fact it is an obligation on, on people to think freely when it comes to aqidah. This is why the scholars, even the, the most traditional scholars in the Shia school of thought, they say there's no taqlid in aqidah. You know, with no taqlid in aqidah, what does that mean? It means that you have to go and study your aqidah yourself. You need to search for your aqidah yourself. You need to prove the existence of Allah. You need to attributes of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, prophethood, the day of judgment, and so on. Right? <laughs> they, they promote the freedom of, uh, of, uh, of, uh, of uh, studying on your own or self-study. On a theoretical level, but unfortunately, when it comes to the practical level, no. <laughs> when it comes to the practical level, you dare to come with a new thought, then you'll be destroyed if you come with a new thought. But then they give you lessons and lessons about not doing taqlid uh, and So there's a contradiction there, unfortunately. <laughs>